Part 1. White Clouds. Horsebow Moon. Rumors of a Reaper. As cold air begins to creep in from the north of Fargus, Fodlan welcomes the riches of fall. The women spend their days reaping the golden fields, gratefully embracing the bounty the goddess has once again provided. The men venture into the wilds with horse bows and empty sacks ready to be filled with game. As I believe you are already aware, Sedith's younger sister Flame has gone missing. At present, all we know for certain is that she has not left Garrick Mach. Flane is not the type of person to just wander off on her own without telling me where she is going. We have searched the monastery thoroughly, but have found nothing. I am now mobilizing the knights to begin searching the town. Troubling rumors have been running rampant lately. I do not wish to consider the worst, but... There are rumors of someone prowling the streets and attacking innocents night after night. The Knights have investigated the matter. They have not discovered any remains, nor have they found any concrete evidence. The people are panicked. They all insist someone called the Death Knight is coming to claim their souls with his blade. There is no way she could have escaped unscathed if she were captured by such a fiend. Where is she? Seteth, recall that impatience begets error. Please do your best to calm yourself. I think of your sister as family as well. You know that. You have my support. We will devote ourselves fully, mind, body, and soul, to recovering her. Professor, your mission for this month is to help find Flane. The Knights have the town covered, so I ask that you focus your efforts on searching the monastery again. We do not have time to waste. You have your orders. Flame has disappeared? Seteth must be beside himself. So, finding little Flame is our mission for this moon? Leave it to me, Professor. Chasing after girls is my specialty. Sylvain, even you must agree that now isn't the time for jokes. I hope Flame is okay. I've heard rumors about some Death Knight running around town. Sounds intriguing. I have been hoping to cross blades with him. Felix! Please consider how Seteth must be feeling right now. In any case, we must start our search at once. Every moment matters. On your order, Professor. Let's try to collect as much information as we can. I'm on the lookout for suspicious individuals. The only place I've yet to check is the library. As you wish. Candlelight. And who is that? No, it isn't. Impossible. Professor, to do. What are you up to at this hour? Your Highness, my apologies. Oh, none necessary. I'm sorry for startling you. I was just doing some research. But I'm just about finished. I didn't realize how late it had gotten. We'd better head back to our quarters to do. Until tomorrow, Professor. A most unusual man. Whatever could he have been looking for so late at night? Hmm? That book is quite askew. He must have rushed to put it back upon the shelf. It seems to be a record of donations from nobility. Arundel. That's not a name I know. But look at that. This Arundel gave quite a sum each year. That is, until the year 1174. He must have died or fallen to financial woe. Hmm. I can't imagine what this has to do with Flane.
A new path to tread. I passed. Easy. Oh, what a relief! Huh, okay. No big deal, really. Hard work. We still don't know where Flane is, but we can't give up. Not until she's found. Professor! Your Highness! I just heard a scream in Professor Yuritsa's quarters! Yuritsa? Ah, the combat professor with the mask. He has always been rather suspicious. We must hurry. Isn't that... Oh, professor Manuela? Professor Manuela! Please wake up! Professor Manuela! No, I believe she's just unconscious. But this wound requires immediate attention. Look! Do you see Professor Manuela's hand? It's like she's pointing at something. I see it, behind that shelf. Could it be a secret passage? What is the meaning of... Wait, is that Manuela? What happened here? We must take her to the infirmary immediately. You, don't just stand there. Help me carry her. Of course. I'll return shortly, Professor. Do you think this is related to Flame's disappearance? What should we do, Professor? It looks dark. Uh, <laughs> dark in there. You've always been scared of dark places, haven't you, Annie? But don't worry. The Professor and I will protect you. There are sounds coming from within. If we're going to investigate, now is the time. We'll be okay. I'm sure of it. Are you ready, Professor?
What is this place? It's so... Ah! I see someone. I think they're unconscious. Yes, I see Flane. But who is this other person? Professor, someone's coming from farther in. That scythe. Is that the knight who attacked the Holy Mausoleum? That sword. You must be. One of us will die. The other will live. I will enjoy this dance of damnation. That night looks like death itself. We must rescue Flane immediately. There's something strange about the flooring at the end of the corridor. Something might happen if you step there. Who, oh, me? Much appreciated. Well done. I'm on it. Be gone. I do. That worked. 
knocked out. A change for the better. I'll give it my all. That's my cue. I'll go. Next time, bring your friends. Ready. Here we go. Stay focused. As expected. I won that?
done is done. Just give up. Some kind of contraption has been activated. Nice try! I aim for greatness. I 
still have much to learn. Thank you. The fight continues. Is this a joke? I feel stronger. What is this device? It appears operational. So you have come. I'll make sure you never leave. Should I have held back?
Predictable. Each battle, a chance to grow. I'm not setting a very good example. Next time, bring your friends. That's how it goes. That one is expected. This is what a real man looks like.
Thank goodness. wasn't with you.
My thanks. Should I have held back? to be done.
Thanks! Change for the better. Done is done. Be gone. It's all becoming clearer. You're weak.
you. Sorry. to serve his highness. I can still serve. I owe you. 
I will get stronger still. Kill them. Halt, you're having a bit too much fun. You are getting in the way of my game. Huh. You'll have more opportunities to play soon. Your work here is done. Understood. I will go. We will cross paths again. I am the Flame Emperor. It is I who will reforge the world. Flame Emperor and the Death Knight? I have to say, they both looked very dangerous. Where did they go? It doesn't matter. We need to get these two out of here. Bring them up. Thank goodness! Those girls are pale as ghosts, but at least they're alive! But that Death Knight person... Feels so familiar. You found Flame? Oh, thank goodness. She was unconscious at the end of that secret passage. We found the culprit too, but he got away. I'm just grateful that everyone is safe. That's what matters most. I'd like to hear what transpired, but first, we need to get these ladies to the infirmary. Understood. We'll go at once. I'm... I'm sorry, Professor. I'm so relieved I suddenly felt weak. I couldn't be happier with how things turned out. And I imagine no one will be more overjoyed than Seteth. Hmm? Hey, Professor. Can you make that expression one more time? I don't think I've ever seen your face like that. <laughs> I apologize. I've forgotten myself and come dangerously close to teasing you. It's just... I've never seen you look so happy before. It's downright mesmerizing. Ah, but this isn't a time for idle chit-chat. We must hurry and share the good news with Seteth. Professor, please allow me to express my eternal gratitude once more. Flane is safe and sound, and I have you to thank for that. Mere words could never express how thankful I am. I... I am indebted to you. Yes, of course. I shall express my gratitude to the students as well. Her kidnapper was the Masked Knight who vanished during the Rite of Rebirth, the one known as the Death Knight. Considering the circumstances, it seems plausible to assume that his true identity is Yuritsa. And we cannot forget about the mysterious Flame Emperor. His true motives are yet unclear. However, I have an idea. I believe the enemy may have been after Flane's blood. The blood that flows through her veins is special. It is extremely rare, and extremely dangerous. If enemies who know the secrets of Flame's blood have appeared, our only option is to leave the monastery and go into hiding. Brother, wait. Flane, what are you doing here? You should be resting. I do not like the path of your thoughts. I do not wish to live in some lonely, remote location where I never get to see anyone. Not ever again. If we stay here, you may be targeted again. Wouldn't it be better for the two of us to live in peace? Even if we ran off to some new, secret location, there is no guarantee that they would not find us. That is why I believe it would be safest to stay in the monastery, where we are surrounded by capable knights and professors. I see your point. I do. However... It... You know it is the only reasonable option. What if I were to join the professor's class?
You think so too? I am so very pleased to hear that. With a professor like you nearby, I shall be safe no matter what foe should appear. I see. I am afraid you have a good point. Professor, due to my position, I have closely scrutinized everything about you. After all that has happened, I must admit that you are indeed a trusted ally. So what say you? Can I entrust you with Flame's safety? I am so glad that Flame is safe. Yet I can't help but wonder what the story is about that other girl. She wore the uniform of the Academy. But who is she? Well done, Professor. I see that I was right to ask your class for assistance. I have been told that Manuela and Flane are recovering nicely, as is Monica. Monica, the girl you rescued along with Flane, is also a student of the Officer's Academy. However... She is a student from last year's class. She went missing just before she would have graduated. It never occurred to us that something might have happened to her at the monastery. We assumed she had run away. I never dreamed that we would find her. Not like this. Monica has asked to rejoin the Black Eagle House once she has fully recovered. Our enemies are still out there, so we must remain cautious and continue our investigation. However, we must also help the students to move on from this incident. After all, the Battle of the Eagle and Lion will be held in Grander Field next month. Yes, the students will remember it for the rest of their lives. Please guide them so that they may show us their best at the coming battle. So, you'll be going to Grander Field next month. You've never been there before, have you? There is unease in the western side of the Empire, but everything east of the capital, Anbar, is stable. Well, there was a noble rebellion a short while ago, but it didn't amount to much. Sorry, but I've got my own mission, and it's far from Grander Field. The Church has always been quick to make use of those who work for them. What I'm more concerned about is finding out who among us is pulling the strings. Ever since the Rite of Rebirth, Strange groups have been seen around Garrig Mach and elsewhere, too. There was also an incident where some knights investigating these suspicious strangers turned up dead. Not that it's likely, but if something like that ever happens to me, search this room, every corner, behind every shelf. I'm going to leave something for you. Don't get me wrong, I have no intention of dying. I know it would be too much to ask you to cheer up, but can you at least drop the serious... <laughs> well, I'll be. Was that a smile just now? <laughs> 